Okay, Marina, I've got a program open called Scribus, and it is a PDF creator. It does a lot of things. It's it's basically a free version of a Adobe Acrobat, kind of. Um, but anyway, so I just open up the default here, and it's real simple. Um, I'm going to, and I'm not sure that yours will work exactly the same, um, but you right-click, and uh, you click on the little image -y thing, insert image frame up here. And when you insert a frame, you go like this. I'm going to zoom out. Uh, once you've inserted your image frame, you just double click on it and you tell it what image to pick. And I've got a viral cancer folder here. And we pick page one. And there it's going to be too big. I right click, click properties, and the image I tell it to scale to the frame size because I inserted that frame. And there's page one. Pretty simple. That way it looks better if you've got some margins in it. Uh, and now I'm going to insert a new. And again, your layout's going to be a little different. I'm working off of Linux. Uh, I'm going to insert a new page in here. Uh, here it is, page, insert. And I'm going to insert two pages, actually. Might as well do that now. And then I just take the image frame and I do that again. Double click it, page two. Same thing, image, scale to frame size. And that's off a little bit size-wise, so I'm going to move it over. So it looks good. Same thing with that one. sure the size is perfect. Uh, again, we choose three. We go to our image area. This is the properties part. Um, up and I'm using my arrow keys to move it up just a touch so it looks good and that's fine okay and then I'm going to click save and I'm going to save it inside the um, <laughs> looking for that file save that this here and then I'm going to click PDF to act to save as a PDF basically the defaults are usually fine for what you want to do if this is only like this is set I don't know if you can see this in here this says resolution for EPS graphics is 300 um, that's that's good if you're printing it if you're not going to print it, you can save the thing down at 72, which is screen size. And you can save it that way, but I'm going to assume, and that will make it much smaller. But I'm going to save it in 300. That way, um, you've got a good print quality version. Okay, so now let's go ahead and open up our little flyer and test it. 
Here it is flyer.pdf. And I'm going to take a look at it. Page 1, page 2. It's got some margin on it. Looks good. That ought to print just fine. Okay, that's it. If you have any questions, uh, let me know.